So I just saw Wicked in the movie theater. I've seen Wicked many years ago as a uh, theater production uh, when I was very little. I have lipstick in my teeth. Anyway, what was I saying? Wicked! Wicked, right. I saw the stage production many years ago when I was very young, and I remember it very clearly because that story was pretty memorable and those songs are, are very memorable. And so even though, I mean, I was very young, I remember it pretty clearly, but you know, I'm not, I'm not as familiar with it as some other people and I've never read the book, although I know some things about it. But I went to the theater with a friend who was big into Wicked and she loved it. And generally, I think people who are fans of the work are going to be happy. The story is there. There's some added scenes. There's a lot of added content from some backstory stuff that's from the book uh, added in, which all those scenes are were pretty fun. I think all those added stuff did affect the pacing a bit. I thought it was a bit padded, a bit slow. Uh, I, I mean, it, it is padded. They cut the story in half like this isn't the whole wicked they this is just part one they end it basically at the end of act one and i think it suffers a bit from that i mean i, I the things they added are nice but at least for me and you know i talk about pacing a lot on this channel I, there was a lot of scenes where they would reach their narrative objective and then kind of keep going for an extra minute or two and I and it wasn't it didn't break the movie for me I still enjoyed the movie but it it did bog it down and I think it made some of the great things about the movie feel a little buried and and overloaded at least that's my feeling it's still a fun movie and I, I know that that sounds harsh because I actually I actually enjoyed it but I, I did notice that I think I think the momentum of the story is a bit off the acting was really fun. Uh, standout, definitely Ariana Grande. She was phenomenal. She completely owned that character. Every scene she was in was absolutely a delight. The comedy for her landed really well. Also a standout for me was Jonathan Bailey, reprising his role as the axis of a love triangle with a popular naive girl who everyone wants to date an opinionated, socially ostracized older sister who he met on horseback and verbally spars with until they get close and personal alone in the woods. But, hey, it's not the worst thing to be typecast as. It's much impossible. But I am leaving for India. And it is not far enough. Do you think that there is a corner of this earth that you could travel to far away enough to free me from this torment? The sexual tension isn't hate levels of intense, but it's not supposed to be. Wicked is not that sort of movie. You are the bane of my existence. And the object of all my desires. The important thing is his chemistry with Galinda and Alphaba is really solid, which doesn't shock me. Uh, he he can make sparks fly with anything. What I've seen of him I've been very impressed with. I didn't know he was in this movie, so it was very it was a delight to see him. There was a lot of comedy in it, though. I I don't know if some of it landed, at least maybe for my movie theater. There was a lot of things that, that were supposed to be laugh out funny that didn't get any laughs from my theater. But it's possible that my theater was just a little uh, serious. But I, I, some of the timing for some of those jokes, I think, were a little off. There was a couple scenes like that that were a little off. Um, like moments that I think were timed to work well in a trailer, but once they're in the context that they belong in, they felt a little off. Like a couple trailer, like the scenes from the trailers where you see them in their actual native setting and they feel a little off, which is very odd. Uh, but again, I'm, I, I feel like I'm griping. It's, it's not, act. It, it, I enjoyed the movie. If you're a fan of Wicked, uh, I think you'd enjoy it a lot. If you're a fan of musicals, it's very fun. The music is great. The, the music's always been great. And the people singing it in this movie are great. It's it's a delight. It's very fun. It was a visual feast. The animals looked great. The uh, locations looked great. 
Everything was gorgeous. The costumes were immaculate every time. Oh my gosh. Gorgeous. Very gorgeous. It was a spectacle. The whole thing was a, a, a feast for the eyes and the ears and was a spectacle. I think its substance, although very present, was a little buried and with it, its extra content and, and kind of slowed it down, at least for me. But it it was a delight to watch. It's just a little long and uh, I think the pacing is a little worsened by them adding so much stuff. The musical was the length it was for a reason, and the at least I think so. Uh, so I feel like it, it it wasn't as tight as it could be. It it made it feel like it lacked a bit of substance. It didn't, which I should say, it had substance. It's just that I think a, the padding almost blunted the effect of it, so it felt more spectacle than substance. Even though I don't think it, it's substanceless at all. I think. Alphaba's character, I I think her character arc I didn't hit me as hard as it did in the musical, and I remember how it hit hard it hit me in the musical, even so long ago, because it stood out to me. Uh, I think the change. She was almost too confident out of herself from the beginning. So her coming into her own didn't feel as satisfying. It's a very minor gripe because it, cause it's not... It's it's just a, it's just a very small thing that I would have preferred if, if that change was more extreme. Uh, but it's fine. I'm excited to see Act, uh, the, <laughs> Act 2 second movie because there it, it will be interesting to see what they how they uh make that work that's what i have to say about that i totally recommend it to people who who like musicals or or, or fans of wicked specifically um if you're not into musicals this is not the thing for you it it's it's a musical uh but i but i enjoyed it and um that was a uh, I, it was a fun movie theater experience for me. I know my videos have come out a little slower. Uh, that's mostly because of the bone song crunch I've been doing to get those chapters out before Kindle Villa collapses. Uh, so if, but I should be picking up soon. So subscribe, definitely subscribe if you want to be notified about that. Anyway, you guys have a good night.